Hello everyone, this is Ratio Word Problems from Prime B6 Mathematics and this is question 10. First, let's read the question. At first, box A had 18 oranges and 42 apples while box B had 36 oranges and 50 apples. Then, some apples were transferred from box A to box B and some oranges were transferred from box B to box A. In the end, the ratio of the number of oranges to the number of apples in box A was 3 is to 4, while the ratio of the number of oranges to the number of apples in box B was 1 is to 2. For part A, how many apples were there in box A in the end? Part B, how many more oranges were there in the box B than box A in the end? Next, let's underline the key phrases for this question. So the first key phrase is that we know that at first, box A had 18 oranges and 42 apples, while box B had 36 oranges and 50 apples. Then, some apples were transferred from box A to box B, while some oranges were transferred from box B to box A. So in the end, the ratio of number of oranges to number of apples in box A was 3 is to 4, while the ratio of number of oranges to the number of apples in box B was 1 is to 2. So we need to find the number of apples in box A in the end and the difference between the number of oranges in box B and box A in the end. So first, for box A, we know that the ratio of oranges to apples is 18 is to 42. While box B, the ratio will be 36 is to 50. Next, we know that there are trans uh, some apples were transferred from box A to box B and some oranges were transferred from box B to box A. So that was this so this ratio will be for before and the ratio after will be for box A the ratio is 3 is to 4 and box B 1 is to 2. So looking at the number of oranges before in box A and box B and the ratio of oranges after for box A and box B. We can form an equation with it because we know that this is an internal transfer question where the total number of oranges for before and after in box A and box B does, doesn't change. Okay, so we can say that 3 units of oranges in box A plus 1 part of oranges in box B. Right, we use units to show the ratio for box A and parts to use to show the ratio in box B. So 3 units plus 1 part will be equals to the total of 18 and 36, which is 54. The next e equation we can make is using the number of apples. So total number of apples is 92 for before and the ratio after will be uh, apples will be 4 units and for box B, the number of apples will be 2 parts. So 4 units plus 2 parts will be equals to 92. Next, because we want to find the number of apples in box A in the end, we need to find the number of units. So we make the parts equal for both equation by multiplying the first equation by 2. So we get 6 units plus 2 parts equals to 108. Next, we subtract the first equation with the second equation. We get 2 units equals to 108 minus 92 equals to 16. So 1 unit will be 8. So at the end, there are 4 units in box A, number of apples. So 4 units will be 32. So for A, there were 32 apples in box A in the end. Next, for part B, we know 1 unit is 8. So we find 3 units. 3 units will be 24 because we want to find the number of oranges in box B and box A. Then you find the difference. So first you find 3 units. Next, we know that this 4 units is actually 32. So 2 parts will be equal to 92 minus 32 will be 60. 1 part will be equal to 30. So this number of oranges in box A in the end is 24. And number of oranges in box B is 30. So the difference will be 6. So there were 6 more oranges in box A than box B in the end. 
Alright, that's all. Thank you. Bye bye.